siempre. Good morning, students and teachers. Welcome to this Tuesday edition of Tiger Cup TV. My name is Reagan. And my name is Brandy. Today is Tuesday, September the 1st. Let's go to all our four sports and one of them. Good morning, KEC. I'm all right. I will be breaking. Get the latest in weather and sports today. You can expect partly cloud skies today. The high is expected to be 89 degrees with the low of 70 degrees. Now for the latest in sports. Auburn High School will be playing at home Friday night against Central at Duck Sanford. Go Tigers! Uh, also, Auburn University's first game of the season is Saturday at 2.30 in Atlanta against Leesville. War Eagle, that's all for now. Back to you, announcers. Thank you, Ola. Remember, habit number one, be proactive today. Here's a short clip about being proactive. Be proactive when you're in charge of your choices. I'm responsible for what I say and do. I do the right thing when no one is looking. I have a counter attitude and follow directions. Now let's go back to Olaf for our lunch meeting. I'm back to bring you the latest from the AEC Tiger Cup Cafe. Today for lunch, we will be having turkey and cheese wrap carrot sticks with dip, baked chips, and an apple, or a chicken wrap box. Sounds like a great lunch. I'm looking forward to it. Back to you, announcers. Thanks, Ola. Those lunches sound delicious. Our lunch ladies make a great lunch. AUC has a chance to win a new imagination playground. All we need to win is for your parents to vote for AEC every day on imagination playground's website. Please remind your parents to vote for AEC. Here is a picture of the Imagination Playground. Kalia Palmer from Miss Sharman's class is our guest pledge announcer. Please stand for the pledge and remain standing for the moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, invisible, with liberty and justice for all. edition of Tiger Club TV. We hope you have a terrific Tuesday and we'll see you tomorrow.